Have you ever played Minecraft? Minecraft! <laughs> and of course I decided to try to make something similar. So Minecraft is made out of cubes. Like, do I have to explain this? It's like, it's Minecraft. It's like saying, do you know what rice is to an Asian kid? So how are we gonna draw all these cubes? If you saw my video about creating a Wikipedia graph, you know that draw calls are slow. It's like calling up a pizza restaurant being like, hey man, could I order one pizza? And then calling them again being like, okay, so I want one pizza and you want 500 of them, no. So drawing every cube one by one would take too long, but we can also not draw some cubes. Okay, so for example, if I have a block like right here, and then I have another block here, then I have another block here, then I have another block here, here, and here, and here. And if these glass planes wouldn't be transparent, I would not see this uh, dirty block. <laughs> So we would not render it. We can even go one step further uh, by combining cubes that have the same value or are the same block. Uh, here we have an example. We have like nine blocks. And what we can do is like, uh, wait, we, and just have one fuck, and just have one quad. Here and do the same thing with the others now instead of drawing like nine cubes we draw three and this is what i started trying to do so i created a chunk and was able to display some blocks and make a heart for my girlfriend yeah i can't believe it either that a fucking failure like me could get a girlfriend but then this guy showed up in my youtube recommendations and started talking about the voxel lattice system if we go back to the greedy meshing we did and instead of pairing different cube sides with each other we instead pair every cube side and while we are at it we take the fucking air with us too so what does this mean well the time of making a new mesh for each chunk is now zero seconds because we have a static mesh that can be used for every motherfucking chunk and that mesh would look something like this and this is what i have done with the voxel lattice system as you can see i can draw millions of millions of cubes uh, i know it's kind of looks fucked up with this you know lines and shit but the point isn't to make it pretty i could make it pretty with lightning and other shit and not make have this mess right here like l look at these grass blocks it's like but what i wanted to do is to draw millions and millions of uh, voxels and that's exactly what i am doing and I think I have succeeded with what I wanted to do. Now you may be asking, wait, 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 wait. But how do we actually get what blocks we want to draw? And how do you even draw the blocks? Well, we just gonna send up a 3D texture to the GPU. And then we're gonna do a check with the local position of the mesh. And then we can get our block type. And then we can also get that texture for that block on a texture atlas. So now, a question. Does this actually work? <laughs> Is it optimal? Well, I, I don't know about ray tracing. Let me know if you want me to try and make ray tracing with voxels, or if you want me to continue with this voxel lattice system and make it prettier and slay, slay your enemies. Rude. If I get 5k views, I will release the source code. Okay, thank you. Bye, bitches. And yeah, I also want to brag a little bit as I made this with fucking Direct X12. And I fucking hate that, okay? I fucking hate that shit. I fucking... But... But you... Yeah.